$800 million. That's how much a federal lawsuit claims the Methodist Healthcare and West Cancer Center Clinic defrauded Medicare and Medicaid programs. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Katina Rankin. And I'm Richard Ransom. This is a big deal, folks, and potentially a huge deal. We're talking about kickbacks given to the doctors of cancer patients. The whistleblowers in the lawsuit are Methodist University Hospital's former CEO, Jeff Liebman, and Dr. David Stern, the former vice chancellor for University of Tennessee's Health Science Center. Local I team's Jenny DePrizio has been digging into this all week long and has this developing story. The federal lawsuit was filed in 2017, but it was sealed until December of last year. Advocates say it's a situation of physician greed over patient need if the allegations prove to be true. This is a massive case. This is a massive case. Jeb White is the head of Taxpayers Against Fraud. He's concerned about the allegations made in this lawsuit. Among the lawsuit's claims from 2012 to 2018, West Cancer and Methodist knowingly defrauded federal and state health care programs. According to the lawsuit, Methodist paid West physicians kickbacks over $400 million. It claims the doctors were given kickbacks for referrals of cancer patients for hospital admissions, chemical infusions, radiation, and outpatient procedures. Methodists took part in a program called the 340B program, which allows the hospital to acquire drugs at deep discounts. The lawsuit claims the hospital would acquire the drugs at the discount and patients' insurance would be charged at a higher rate. Then West Physicians and Methodists would split the difference. The lawsuit also alleges the hospital paid West $25 million to manage the business at the hospital's infusion center and paid off $7 million in West's debt, which included $3.5 million of personal debt as a supposed investment in their for-profit research company. Methodist denies the claim. Tuesday, this statement was released to WATN-TV. It says in part, Methodist Labonner Healthcare upholds the highest standards and complies with all legal and regulatory requirements. Our professional agreements with the West Clinic and its physicians provided needed medical services for cancer patients. Our payments for the services provided were appropriate. It goes on to say the lawsuit lacks merit and we will continue to vigorously defend ourselves. These cases involving cancer patients raise uh, concerns above any other cases, right? These are some of our most vulnerable patients. And the fact that, you know, the allegations involve patients potentially uh, not receiving the care that they should have because a provider is making a decision based on their own profits as opposed to patient need raises a lot of red flags for us. I called and emailed West Clinic and its lawyers several times yesterday and today. So far, no comment from either. Coming up tonight at 6 o'clock, find out why the case was sealed and why the feds could intervene. Jenny DiPrizio, Local 24 News.